Superior mesenteric artery syndrome, SMAS, is a rare, life-threatening gastrointestinal disorder caused by the compression of the third portion of the duodenum between the abdominal aorta and the superior mesenteric artery, SMA. This condition typically results from a significant decrease in the angle between the aorta and SMA, often caused by rapid weight loss, trauma, or other conditions that lead to the loss of the mesenteric fat pad. SMERS is classified into two main types, acute and chronic, depending on the onset and duration of symptoms. The acute form usually follows sudden, significant weight loss or trauma, while the chronic form is associated with more gradual weight loss and often presents with intermittent symptoms. The causes of SMERS are largely related to factors that reduce the angle between the aorta and the superior mesenteric artery such as rapid weight loss, severe trauma, surgical correction of spinal deformities, or other conditions that deplete the fat and lymphatic tissue in the mesentery. Risk factors for developing this syndrome include significant weight loss due to anorexia nervosa, cancer, burns or prolonged bed rest, as well as congenital anatomical variations that predispose individuals to a reduced aortomesenteric angle. Patients with SMERS typically present with symptoms of severe postprandial abdominal pain, nausea, vomiting, early satiety, and significant weight loss. In some cases, these symptoms may be accompanied by bloating and diarrhea. The symptoms are often exacerbated by eating and relieved by lying down or positioning oneself in a way that widens the aortomesenteric angle. Treatment options for SMERS focus on relieving the duodenal compression and addressing the underlying cause. Initial management may involve nutritional support, such as the use of nasojejunal feeding tubes to bypass the obstructed segment and promote weight gain. In cases where conservative measures fail, surgical intervention may be necessary. The most common surgical procedures include Strong's procedure, which involves division of the ligament of triads to mobilize the duodenum, and duodenal jejunostomy, which creates a bypass around the compressed duodenal segment. Nursing care for patients with SMERS is centered around managing symptoms, providing nutritional support, and monitoring for complications. This includes regular assessment of pain and discomfort levels, ensuring adequate hydration and nutritional intake, and educating patients and their families about the condition and its management. Postoperative care, when surgery is required, involves monitoring for signs of infection, ensuring proper wound care, and encouraging gradual reintroduction of oral intake as tolerated by the patient. Subscribe us for more videos like this and visit bazaarbiblio.com for notes and free PDF books. Thank you.